know what this video is. Um, I found my formal dress on his school and life has been very hectic. Ending of my relationship. This is what she looks like. back to my channel if you're new here my name is chloe and um i haven't made a video for ages and i'm gonna explain it in a second i really don't know what this video is i'm literally just gonna document anything that i feel like over the next few days i'm kind of vibing more with just the all over the place random videos rather than the really structured videos if that makes sense i have taken like a few weeks off because school and life has been very hectic i'll give you the quick little rundown of my 2021 so far in january 2021 i started year 12 um, I ended up ending my relationship just because I needed to focus on myself. So in a relationship, I need to focus on school. And I just want to live my life being a teenager. I have my whole life for relationships. So yeah, I ended my relationship in January. It is currently the 13th of March. And then I started school. It got really hectic. I've had like four mental breakdowns and it's only term one. But we're currently going into week eight of term one. So I just don't like high school i'm not thriving this year I'm vibing with high school i just want to be done do something for my life rather than wasting my time learning stuff that i don't care about but yeah my english assignment in term one was very stressful it's fine i submitted it hopefully i get a c i think i find out this week so i'll let you guys know i did my dance assessment and i got Pretty good marks for that. I got an A. Next life update. Formal related. I found my formal dress. I'm not going to be showing you guys my formal dress until like my formal get ready with me in June. But yeah, that's that. Um, I've just been vibing with my friends. I went on leadership camp. It was pretty fun. It's probably like one of the best camps that I've been on. I went on dance camp, which is fun as well. It was very tiring. But because I went to those two camps, I missed out on so much work in maths. Like literally maths took the biggest hit and after trying to catch up my first exam for ATAR is next Tuesday which I'm kind of stressing about all my other subjects are pretty fine oh my god so I got so overwhelmed with my workload and I actually dropped a subject I dropped meteor up if you don't understand the system for ATAR you need general and applied subjects and then also a like a vet subject a cert subject so I do four general one applied and one cert I think so I dropped my applied it only goes towards QCE and I'm like doing fine for QCE so I just thought that I would get that extra lesson time to actually study at school so that I study less outside of school I also got a lash trial because I wanted to see if my eyes would swell up from lashes and they didn't they actually look so good. That's what they look like. Um, oh, I also changed my room around today because I just wanted a fresh start. And I also like get really bored. I literally did like the littlest change. So don't mind how messy she is, but this is what she looks like. So my bed used to be here and then the desk used to be over here, but I just switched them. I'm kind of vibing with this layout more. I'm a cute little plant that my friend gave me. So yeah, if you guys want a room tour, just let me know. Also, I think I'm on like 415 subs. Guys. My goal this year was literally 300 and it's now March and we're at 415. If there's any videos you actually want to see, then just, I guess, let me know in the comments. I also forgot to tell you this uh, life update. I actually got a job. I wasn't even looking. I just saw this job on like one of the job searching things. I was like, yeah, sure, I'll apply. I applied and then they got back to me and wanted an interview. And after the interview, I was like, yeah, it's whatever. And then I ended up getting the job. I'm not gonna disclose where it is because privacy. The first shift is in two weeks, I think. You guys all OOTD for that you didn't ask for. My hair is just in this hairstyle that I literally always do. I have this cute little necklace that my auntie gave me, I think for my 17th birthday. Um, I have this shirt from Valley Girl. It's ribbed. You can't really tell, but it is. It's so comfy. It has padding as well, which is amazing. And then I have this skirt, which is also from Valley Girl. Um, it was on sale from like 17 down to like 7 or something. I don't know. But yeah, it's really cute. I love the little slit and that has like this little detailing. Can you see? Yeah. And then I just have my um, Apple Watch and my Pandora bracelet and then these two rings. And then makeup wise, I just brush my eyebrows, brush my lashes and put on a little bit of concealer like in here. 
It is now Sunday the 14th of March. I'm about to go to Kmart to get some photos printed, but I'll give you a quick OTD. And this is a pretty similar outfit to yesterday, but I just have this singlet. I think it's from Kmart. I have my same necklace, same watch, same Pandora bracelet. Then I have this ruffle skirt from Ellie, I think, and then I've got no shoes on yet. And then I'm wearing no makeup. I just brush my eyebrows and then I brush my lashes. But I'm going to put a photo wall here because the wall is like so bare and just white so i'll show you the photos once they've been printed this is what my room looks like when it's kind of tidy apart from this rubbish bag that's just so i just got all of my photos i got some like aesthetic ones and then some of my own ones so yeah they're all gonna go up there there's a few that are like um portraits so i have to try and get those out and i also bought some blue tack for two dollars fifty <laughs> So I did start by putting up here, but I just thought that I'd start from the bottom and work up. I'll probably put another row below though. So this is the progress that I've made. I still have all of these. These are like my actual photos and then these are the aesthetic photos. So I'm kind of doing like one of mine, an aesthetic photo, one of mine. You get the gist. I think I showed you guys the end product, but this is what my wall is looking like at the moment. I'm gonna eventually get photos to go up here. But when I first did it, this bottom line was going like slanted up this way. But I had to like reposition them and now they're like fairly straight. 